In this video, we're going to take a closer look at how we work with slides in Keynote on the Mac. This includes how we add slides, rearrange them, as well as skip or hide them. Let's take a look at slides in Keynote on the Mac. Let's go to my Mac. So I'm in Keynote here, and if we look over to the left, you're going to see I have my slides. If I want to add a new slide, we just go up to the Add Slide here in the toolbar, and when I click on it, I can select from a number of different slide templates. Each one of these is a little bit different, and they're based off of a master slide. I'll talk about master slides in another video. But here we have the title at the top. With this one here, we have Photo 3 Up. This one here is Title and Bullets. Now, once you add one of these slides, you can change it. So let's go and add Photo 3 Up. I just click on it, and it adds it. If I wanted to change something here, maybe I want to add some text to it in addition to these photos or maybe remove one of these photos, I can do that. All you have to do is just select the object that you want to delete. So I'm going to go with this object here. I hit the delete key, it removes it. To add some text, I just go up to text here, click, and I've added my text. So we can change a slide once we've added it. Over on the left, we have all of our different slides, and what we can do is rearrange these. All we have to do is just drag them around to rearrange them. We can also hide them. Let's say you're working on a presentation and you have to do a shorter version of it. Well, instead of deleting a slide, what you can do is you can skip it. How do you skip it? Well, you just select it, and then you go down to Control on your keyboard, and you're going to see Skip Slide. I select this, and now that slide here is skipped. If I were to play this in my presentation here, it would skip that slide. It's almost like it is hidden. If you want to show the slide again, you just select it, and then hold down the control key and click, and you're going to see unskip slide. And there is my slide that I skipped. We do have different views for these slides. If I go up to view here, I can view these as Navigator. This is how I will usually view them. We can just see all the slides over here on the left. But we also have Slide Only, which hides that Navigator. And then we can also go to Light Table. This will show all of our slides in a thumbnail. Select this, and now we can see them in a thumbnail. A nice view to get an overall look at your slideshow. When you're in this view, you can drag them around to move them just like when it's in its navigator view. And then we also have, under view, outline. With outline, this just gives us an outline to the slide. Now you're going to see that this one has a title where these do not. Why is that? Well, it's pulling that title here from a field or from a text field. So when I go to tulip time here, you're going to see that I have this text in here. This is where it is pulling that title from, which means with these, I do not have any text in there. So as you modify your slides, you're going to start seeing this fill in a little bit more. If I click on number five here, double click to edit, and then I go title, you're going to see it adds that title there. We can also, when we go over to view, edit our slide layouts. I'll talk about that in another video. And then we can Show, find, and replace, show the rulers, hide comments, and show our presenter notes. I'm going to go back to Navigator View. This is typically how I view my slides. Select it, and now we have all of our slides here. If you want to delete a slide, all you have to do is just select it. Let's go with the slide that I added here. I want to delete it. It's selected. Just hit the delete key, and it removes it. So that's a quick look at slides and how we add them as well as rearrange them and hide them. We also have a few different views for them. When you add a slide, you select it from the theme. Once you add that slide, you can go and change that slide. So let's say you added a slide that has three images in it or two images, or you added a slide that doesn't have any images. You can go and add more objects to that slide. It's just a starting point. 
to rearrange them, you view your navigator and just drag them up and down to rearrange them. You can also skip them by control clicking on it, hold down the control key and click, and you can skip a slide. When you skip a slide, when you're playing your presentation, your slideshow, it will skip that slide. Select it again and control click on it, and then you can unskip it. And then you also have various views. So that's a look at how we add our slides as well as arrange them and skip them in Keynote on the Mac.